I'm Jessica Fisher from Good Cheap Eats, and today we're gonna make Irish stew. This recipe for Irish stew is simple and flavorful. Full of chunks of hearty meat, potatoes, and carrots, it's ultimate comfort food. I'm gonna start by prepping my onion. I'm gonna peel it and chop it into small bits that I'm gonna saute later for the stew. Next, I'm gonna chop up two pounds of chuck roast into one inch cubes. In a tray, I'm going to combine one fourth cup flour, one teaspoon salt, and half a teaspoon pepper. Now roll the beef cubes in the flour mixture till they're thoroughly coated. Once all the beef cubes are rolled in flour, let's brown them in a skillet. Start by heating two tablespoons of olive oil in the pan. Once it's shimmering hot, add the beef cubes to the pan, spreading them out. You don't want them to be crowded. Turn them and brown them on all sides. If you need to do this in batches, that's perfectly okay. Just move the browned cubes to your crock pot while you finish cooking the rest. Once all the beef cubes are cooked, and transfer to the crock pot, add your onions to the pan. Cook the onions until they're slightly translucent and brown around the edges. Add the onions to the slow cooker along with one half cup beef broth and a bay leaf. Stir to combine, cover and cook for two hours on high or four hours on low. Now as the initial cooking time is reaching its end, Let's peel and chop four medium potatoes and measure out two cups of baby carrots. I add these to the slow cooker, stir, cover the pot, and allow it to continue cooking for two hours on high or four hours on low. When the final cooking time is complete, remove the bay leaf and enjoy your homemade Irish stew.